Well, we're back in the attic. We are. It's Tuesday, mm -hmm. therefore. <laughs> therefore, it's time to be in the attic. And for a while, we've been doing large-scale passenger cars and freight cars and rolling stock of all kinds. It's going on the new Garden Railroad, which is mm -hmm. over there. Mm -hmm. All of this stuff is moving from here to over the freight there. Uh, yard, which is over there. Mm -hmm. uh, we're laying for track real. over there as we speak, so we're actually ready to unbox a few of these things. Mm -hmm. This is an AMS flat car. And uh, Bachman makes a, a similar flat car and so on. One of the neat things about a flat car is it's the basis of all the other cars. Mm. The, the basic chassis of these things is pretty much the same from one car to another to another to another. And uh, the only thing is, because it's the heart of the car, they're still pretty expensive. You're not going to pay a lot less for a flat car. But if you had a notion to pseudo-scratch build, a uh, oh. a high side gone or something so you, you wanted to do real wood or something you can build the superstructure everything above the the running gear and just start off with this little guy right mm -hmm. here well, that, let's, let's see what this undo is some tape here we've already peeled it from the box because sometimes <laughs> getting these AMSs out of the box orange you getting tired of peeling your orange, train orange <laughs> you getting tired <laughs> Heck, I peel apples, so... Yeah. Uh, okay. I thought we peeled around corners, too, while we were at it. Well, of course. Oh, oh hey, look at this. Okay. Okay, Is whoops. Caught? There we go. A little bit. They gave you a polishing cloth. Oh, that's the gum stuff to hold it in place. Okay, let's take a Turn. look at, at what we've uncovered here at this point. Mm. Oops. It's uh, wrapped in a interior thing thingamajig and... Uh, one thing about cars like the flat cars, they're a lot less likely to get broken. As we've pointed out in the past, um, the heavier the car, the mm -hmm. more likely it is to get damaged in shipment and, and even in operation and right. stuff. Kinetic energy being what it is. Do, do we need to repurpose these things? All these little packages? Don't eat it, it says. It says don't eat it, but I'm thinking feed bags. <laughs> You could just stack them up and have the silica gel train. Just yes. Put them see, here look, on your flat right here. car. I mean, yeah. look, see? We, we're going to repurpose there those, guys. Just, it's I mean, a, it's a why throw it away? Yeah. It's dog food load. or something. No, not Let's dog see. food. Can we but... stash that over there? Anyway. <laughs> um, but you can see it's it's got these steak pockets um, all along the, the side of the car. And well, for a gondola, they, that's, those are the supports that hold up the, the sides and so on and so forth. Yeah. So what you have here is, is a car. I mean, you can Just build a box car on mm -hmm. top of this. You can build a caboose on top. Well, the caboose is a little different. But a box car, a reefer, a gondola, a low side gondola, not a drop bottom con. Needless to say, that's a no. Uh, but this living quarters <laughs> um, is the is the basis for so many different cars, mm -hmm. and they've done such a bang up job wow. on this running gear. I'm just That's really just really impressed, and uh, and these are you know, expensive, but they're not as expensive as buying a whole car. I think you can pick these up for around 80 something like wow. that, maybe. I, I don't know. You could put your Gatling gun on and there. With eBay, you just, yeah, you, she, she, <laughs> she built me a Gatling, a Gatling gun. gun. It'll, same scale. So. Uh, set that up it's there. a nice looking Gatling gun, it is. I might it point was, out. It that's, was fun, yeah. You but that's one of the fun things it. with a flat car is you everything's exposed. Mm -hmm. And you can build a wooden buckboard or you can put a steam tractor or just yeah. there's so many just fun loads that you can put on one of these and say like, seriously look at that coming by yeah a gatling gun would <laughs> a gatling gun would get attention with some some soldiers taking their gatling gun to battle mm -hmm. or something like that maybe it's just going to a, a show yeah it's got the uh the typical ams uh, pseudo working coupler the paint is on this one and it's kind of hanging it up mm never been used before but you can uh, it works you can work the handle mm -hmm. this one is a being sticky. a bit petulant yeah it needs to be used and these springs are a little tight too all of these you, you always spend a certain amount of time 
working things in and figuring things out, rarely are things going to run directly out of the box exactly the way you want. Um, for the most part, there's, there's no damage under here. A lot of these, when we open them up, they're damaged. Especially where they've been moved from California to Utah and back and forth and all around. I'm surprised you have anything left. Even though they've never been out of the boxes, by the time you get them out of the boxes, all that moving around and everything is, mm -hmm. has done some kind of damage to it. Right. But in this case, no, that one's perfect. Right. Well, that's good. Perfect. Awesome. That's really neat. Well, anyway, <laughs> if, uh, if you haven't been over to the channel, pop on over to the channel. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Right. The easy way to subscribe. Are we ready for it? Mm hmm Zoink. Blue button. Right, over there. <laughs> right. There. right. <laughs> well, we're not sure how you found this movie on the internet. And we hope you didn't find it boring. And we will see you here on Sunday. Sunday. Because we're going to be driving around and screwing around looking for cool things. And, and we'll find them. And, and we will. <laughs> see you then. See you. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>